Hi everyone. In this video, I will show how to calculate the current in simple diode circuits using cir circuit simulation. First, let me explain about the circuit simulation software tools in general. Most circuit simulation software packages are based on SPICE, which is the acronym for Simulation Program with Integrated Circuit Emphasis. The main part of the program is using the circuit equation uh, which uh, in general are KVL and KCL equations. We don't write the equations, but we create a net list which describes how the terminals of different components are connected together. Another part is the relationships between the current and voltage of the devices. For example, in a resistor, current and voltage are related by Ohm's law. In our circuit, the relationship of the diode is an exponential relationship between uh, diode current and diode voltage. These definitions are defined as a model. There are numerous circuit simulation packages. Some are open source and some are commercially available. Some are very simple and can handle small or medium-sized circuits, and some are very complex and more powerful with a rich model library and can handle any size of circuits. Multisim from National Instruments is a very powerful circuit simulation package it is based on XSPICE, which is an open source version of SPICE. Multisim Live is a lighter web based version which has a more user friendly interface and is easier to build the circuit and run the simulation. In this video, I will use Multisim Live to simulate this simple circuit and find the current in the circuit. To make a circuit simulation, we need to build a circuit. It means that we need to create a netlist. Fortunately, we don't need to write the netlist. In most simulation packages, you can draw the circuit in the main area which is usually called uh, schematic capture or just schematic. Uh, in Multisim Live, drawing the circuit is very simple. You have got the components on the toolbar, and so you can put the components uh, anywhere that you like uh, in the uh, uh, schematic capture area and then connect them together. Uh, in the simple circuit that we have, uh, we have one battery or DC source. We can find it from sources here. There are different types of sources. We need a DC voltage. I select that and I put it here. Uh, we need a diode, which I can drag and put it somewhere here. And also we have a resistor. I put it there and I rotate this resistor. And now I need to connect these components together. Before that, uh, we need 